country in a different year. We're in Spain and we just wanted to share with you guys a little bit of our experience at Viva, which was the first event ever in um, trying to bring different people from Europe. Mm -hmm. So how, was, how is this for you? I don't know if I knew what to expect from Viva. Like, we haven't had time to think about it, but I've had such incredible settling mm. and opening. Um, and I think a lot of what I thought I knew about the principles again has just fallen away and it's, it's new stuff coming. Mm. Um, I've loved hearing all of the different speakers. Everyone has shared from their heart what means something to them about these principles and about the world, really. Um, and I think it was funny seeing you on stage. It was it funny. It took me back, mm. like, six years ago when we met. I had come on... I had come out of myself so much from seeing Roger Mills and, you know, that was ten years ago. Mm. So I was four years in, but I was still so reserved and so closed-hearted in a way. Mm. It opened me up, but not in the same way. And I think there was something about hanging out with, with you and seeing, seeing the work in, the, in, the, um, in Santa Clara that really just made me see this is true. Mm. This is true of people. And to then see you as part of the European Conference mm. and bringing you just your love mm. and your easiness with this to be part of Viva has been incredible. And to know that you've done a Spanish day, that it's... Yes, that I know that's been exciting. one of your dreams back then. That was what, yeah, that's been one of my dreams all along because I do speak Spanish and um, I just have this wish, you know, to share these principles in Spanish. And so, yeah, having the opportunity of doing the whole day with people here was just wonderful. Um, and, it, you know, for me, it's been just recognizing the human spirit wherever we go and um, there has been participants from all over Europe really and different languages and different cultures and yet there is this human commonality that I just have felt so connected to you know so it's almost like finding your long lost twin in a sense except you have 64 in the room or 100 or whatever and each one of the speakers and each one of the people that I've come a across has this deep desire to be loving and helpful in the world. And uh, also fun, you know? I think there was this great sense of lightheartedness. So, um, so there are also uh, dates that have been set, right, for the next Viva. Will you be here? I hope to be here. 2016, and it's going to be November 19th through the 21st. So we look forward to seeing you there.